Okay, so here's the deal. Um, I typically am not into transmogs at all. However, since Love is in the Air is uh, coming up very soon, actually on Monday in World of Warcraft, um, I got this sudden urge to make my way over to the trading post. So I flew over to and I took a look to see what was in here. And I like died in happiness. Now again, I'm not like a mog person. So here I am testing everything. There's look at the bows. Look at how cute. If you're a hunter, oh, I got this for my priest, by the way. This is a back piece. It's so cute. It's so cute. This I don't even, oh, the crown was like, whatever. I was like, not into it. There's like some cool swords. Check that out. You know, very good for your plate wearing peeps. I got that staff. Totally have that staff. Here's like a darker version. Um, the purple or whatever they're calling it. I forget the void or whatever. This is like a monk thing. I don't even know why they keep putting these out because they're lame. Blah, blah, blah. Look at these ducks. Look at these. How great for like a shaman or a warrior. Oh my God. I cannot wait. I'm going to get these for my shaman. I only got a few pieces. This little wand action. Definitely going to get that for one of my offhands for sure. But I <laughs> I ran out of tokens. So I think I actually have to move to another character. Look at this shield. Look how cute it is. It's so cute. Another wand, but like the void or the, what are they calling it? The gothic, the gothic one. And this glorious dress. I think a lot of people already have this. Like if you're on Moonguard, you know what's up here. Um, this tabard is great. If you are somebody who runs in the gnome run every single year in October for breast cancer awareness, this is a fabulous little tabard. The gloves, fabulous, fabulous. Now it looks weird because of the actual gloves I have on for my character. But if you hide the armor, look how good they look. This fuchsia pink is mm, beautiful, beautiful. We got a couple um, bouquets here. We got like the red rose bouquet. Then, of course, uh, we have this glorious little sarong. Check it out. Great for your role play peeps. I'm not really into it, but whatever. Um, the shoulder drapes. I saw so many people. A lot of plate wearers wearing this, actually. I'm, I might get it for my, um, my paladin. Okay. Now these pets. <gasps> Look at They have little hearts. Little hearts. It's a little love bug. <gasps> Look how cute it is. And look, there's Nell. So they have two of them. There's a purple one and a red one. If you're into pets like me, and I don't know why, because I'm not like a Pokemon lover. Not that I don't like Pokemon. But like, I'm very into pets. I had to get them both. And now look at this. Okay. Now, I did this after the fact because I did purchase this mount because I think the foxes are the cutest thing. They are just so cute. And they remind me of my ferrets, which I have seven. Um, so I bought this. thought it was adorable. It's like the Glimmer Fur Fox, which I mentioned later on. Look how cute it is. Another shield, whatever. This is a returning thing, whatever. It's kind of like, I mean, I guess it's cool if you're like into that kind of thing. Um, some matching swords. Great for your DKs and uh, warrior peeps. Another corsage. We have a fancy little corsage. Then a goth one, because, you know, sometimes you like to have the dark roses, you know what I'm saying? And then the, the light purple one, which is called Rosie. Rosie, that's my name. I do have this, this little cape action here. Although, I love the idea for the hood for, like, a rogue, but, like, yeah, it doesn't work with anything that I have. This I actually love. I wear this on a couple of my characters. It just looks really good. I don't know. I like the one without the hood a little bit better. But I love the color. So, yeah. This is what's at the trading post. Right here so get me. there. Get there. And also you get points. For all the things that you do, you might get some free stuff. So here we are. We're going to open them. So here's the cool thing. If you get the mount, you go into your little mount area and it looks like a little gift. Right? Look how cute. Of course, you got to right click and favorite that, you know, because it's adorable. And then the thing with the pets, I thought the pets would also be in like a little gift box, but they're not. So you have to actually remember their names to search for them. <laughs> and they're all level one. So if you are like me and you still have your garrison, I highly recommend you get on your characters, go to your garrison and do your daily pet battles. You get a crap ton of tokens and you can level these little babies up.
Okay. That's what I like to do. Again, I'm like a pet person. So yeah, that is my jam. And that is what we have at the trading post. Okay. So I decided I would mount this real quick and show you because I thought it would be like, um, I thought it would be like the glimmer Fox where it just kind of does this really tall leap. <gasps> you guys, ah, it flies. I it flies it's so look how cute oh my god uh the only thing that would make this better is if it was a, a two-person mount i think but oh my god i just was so excited when i saw that it flies ah! anyway that's it that's the other thing i wanted to show you like look how adorable oh you beautiful little thing you Look at this. Aww, look at little Foxy baby. So cute. So cute. Oh my god. Oh my god, his paws have little hearts. I can't even. It reminds me of my ferrets. Okay, this is the cutest freaking mount ever. Oh my god, Becky. Okay, great. Okay, that's it. This is the Forever Friendship Fox. <laughs> okay, that's all. Okay, bye.